How to support an artist when you're on a budget. Artists express themselves through their art, whether it's through drawing and painting, sculpture, music, or any other creative medium. However, we know it can get pretty expensive to buy artwork you enjoy. It's okay if you can't purchase anything right now, but there are still a lot of things you can do to support their work. Keep reading for a variety of ways to promote any local or mainstream artist you know without spending a dime. 1. Spread the word about their amazing work. Talk up the artists you like so your friends check them out. Word of mouth is one of the best ways to get the person's name out to the people you're close with. Show their work to your friends, family, and anyone else you think will like it to make them into new fans. 2. Share their work online. Reach more of your friends by reposting the artist on your own feed. If you don't already follow the artists you like on social media, find them on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. Share their posts so other people that follow you are exposed to their work. That way, you can get your friends and family hyped about the work so they gain more followers. Try to share the post directly from the person's account rather than making a new post with the picture. That way, the artist sees how popular posts are and you ensure they get credit for their work. 3. Leave positive comments on their social media posts. Let the person know you like their work so they feel encouraged. Visit the artist's social media pages and look for posts that you really love. Like the post and say something about how the piece makes you feel in a comment. You don't have to comment on every single one of their posts, but even one positive message can help someone feel like they're putting out good work. For example, you could say, I really love the colors in this piece. I can't wait to see more. If you're supporting a musician, you could say something like, that guitar solo during the chorus is so sick. I'm so excited for when you release an album. 4. Tag artists in social media posts. Link to the work on social media posts to drive traffic to their page. If the artist you want to talk about is on social media, look for their username and be sure to include it in the post you're writing. They will get a notification that you tagged them and know you're supporting them, but you'll also make it easier for people that follow you to find more of their work. You can either write your own post or reply to a thread where someone's asking for recommendations. Try incorporating a hashtag into your post for even more visibility. For example, for the hashtag number 10 days 10 albums, share a picture and link for one of your favorite albums every day for 10 days. Then, you can write a short caption about why you love it to convince other people to listen too. 5. Stream their work. Watch videos, stream music, and join live streams to show your support. Look up the artist on websites like YouTube and Twitch and subscribe if they have a channel. Whenever they release a new video or go live, tune in and watch them. If you want to support a musician, see if you can play their songs on streaming services, such as Bandcamp, Apple Music, or Spotify. This can help boost their views and increase their popularity so more people get exposed to their work. Stay up to date on the artist's social media pages to see when they're releasing new content. 6. Write a fun blog post about the artist. Share what you love about the creator and their work in more detail. If you already run a blog, drop a post in your regular feed for your readers. When you're writing about the artist, discuss what you like about the art and how it makes you feel so you can convince other people to check it out. Add a few pictures of the work, making sure to ask for permission and giving credit to the person who made it. Include links to all of the artist's social media pages so someone reading can easily go to their pages. For example, you could make blog posts titled something like, 5 Digital Artists You Should Follow Right Now or My Favorite Indie Albums of 2020. 7. Go to free shows and receptions. See the artist and their work in person if they're in the area. Check the artist's website or social media pages to see if they've announced any public showings. It could be a gallery opening, art talk, closing reception, or concert. If you can, invite a few friends and try to show up for a little while to get other people in your community interested in their work. Many artists base future appearances or performances on how many people show up. If they have a large crowd show up, they might be more willing to come back for their next shows. 8. Connect them with potential customers. Give the artist's information to people who need their services. Try to find the contact information for artists you like or ask for a business card if you meet them in person. If someone you know is looking for a commission or wants unique art, pass along the information you have. That way, someone who does have the money to support the artist can make a purchase. For example, if you have a friend that's a painter, you could say, oh my friend does these really amazing abstract paintings that are exactly what you're looking for. Let me give you his business card. 9. Lend them a hand. Volunteer to help an artist friend with any work they need to be done. Reach out to your friends that make art in your area and see if there's anything you can offer them, such as helping set up for a show or posing for their work. If they do need something, willingly step in to help without expecting anything in return. 
they will be really grateful that you're helping them even if you can't afford their pieces. 10. Offer helpful critiques. Give feedback if you're close with the artist and also a creative. Only give critiques directly to people if they're your friend and they respect your opinion. Whenever the artist is working on new pieces, give them your honest feedback about how the art makes you feel. If you have any ideas for the piece, talk it over with them. That way, you show that you really care about their work and want the best for them. For example, you could say something like, the color red comes across as aggressive or angry in this piece. Is that what you were intending? Some people may not be as receptive to your critique as others. Remember that it's their art and they don't need to listen to any feedback you give them.